understanding is you need a steady supply of deridium to keep your cell structure stabilized, or bad things start to happen. And we have plenty of deridium in sickbay, so there's no risk of running out. Thank you. Feel free to make yourself at home. And help yourself to whatever you like from the replicator. The first mineral Captain Solano ever discovered. Always was the nostalgic type. I can't believe he keeps this around. Don't even know where mine is. Just a sip of something. Coffee. Perfect temperature. Don't know how they do it. Jara Rydek. Last time I saw you, it was graduation from the Academy. You'd already secured one of the most prestigious assignments possible. And you were burning with enough ambition to fuel seven trips around the Necrot Expanse. It's good to see you again, Captain. Well, I could not be happier to have you on the Resolute. My only regret is that we couldn't provide you with a warmer welcome. The arrival of a first officer to her new ship deserves a bit of fanfare. I have to admit, I was expecting something bigger. At least a marching band, or a parade. <laughs> we'll see if we can't make up for it somehow. As I'm sure you've heard, we've had a rough go of it these last six months. The ship suffered some damage, but not nearly as much as the crew. I assume you mean the accident. That's right. The tragic accident, really. We were on the verge of a major scientific breakthrough. A quantum leap forward in warp core technology. 10,000 teradynes per second. The ability to travel at a sustained rate of speed longer and faster than we ever dreamed. What would have been the crowning achievement of my career? Right there, within our grasp. <sighs> Until it all went so horribly wrong. We pushed her too hard and a warp core malfunction overloaded the system, creating a pressure gradient way beyond what the ship can handle. It was heartbreaking. We lost some of our best people. As captain, I have to take full responsibility. It was my decision to make, and I have to live with the consequences. You have to look to the future. You can't dwell on the past on things you can't change. There's nothing that can be done about it now. In my defense, I will say, I might have avoided the whole ordeal if my senior staff had been willing to trust me. There was a lot of pushback from my former XO. And I, I think that cost me his confidence. I don't want you to pull any punches. Certainly not on my account. But once we decide on a course of action, I need everyone to fully commit to the mission. Anything short of that just won't work. And that's when things start to go sideways. And what happens if they don't? There's a chain of command for a reason. And we all have our orders. That's true. Everyone on this ship should know that. Sometimes the occasional reminder doesn't hurt. Look, I'll be blunt. We can't afford another mistake. Or at least, I can't. I feel like my career is hanging in the balance here. We need a win. Something to restore the crew's confidence. 
I understand.